Good morning, Crockett Colts, and here are your daily announcements. An announcement from our cheer coach. Join the pep squad. Packets can be picked up in the front office and are due back to Ms. Garcia in room 216. We are also looking for a mascot. There will be a pep squad meeting after school this Friday. Welcome the newest members of the Crocky Podcast Club, Tamia Bounds and Mylene Salinas. The podcast club meets every Monday after school. New members, please check your school emails for an email from Ms. Maxie. The podcast club still has three open spots, so if there's anyone interested in joining, you can get an application from Ms. Maxie in Portable 5. You can listen to the Student Voices podcast on Spotify and the Anchor app. This word growth mindset, which I believe you came up with. Mm -hmm. um, when did you come up with that? What was the motivation and what is it? A growth mindset is when students believe that their abilities can be developed. A fixed mindset is when they think, I just have a certain amount and that's it. And this isn't just kind of feel good talk. This is actually based in science that you actually exactly the brain actually does grow stronger. Neural connections actually do form when you struggle. In study after study, we have shown that kids who have a growth mindset get higher grades. It's not a choice between the outcome and the mindset. It shows that if kids engage deeply and effectively in a learning process, the grades and test scores are a natural byproduct. Kids who are praised for their intelligence, our research shows, don't want to challenge afterwards. They don't want to work hard on something. And if they hit difficulty, that's it. We find that when we praise or parents praise the process the child engages in, their hard work, but not just hard work, their strategies, their ideas, their focus, their perseverance. Then the student learns these are the ingredients of success. If it gets harder, I'll just do these things. We've already done work with you of um, inserting growth mindset statements before math problems. And we found together that kids did better so one thing that I hope is the folks listening to the, these videos go out there and tell their parents, tell their children, tell their peers, tell their teachers, tell their students about growth mindset. Tell them that their brain grows when they get a question wrong, when they struggle, when they look at their errors and they say, hey, that's an interesting. You shouldn't be ashamed of your mistake. You should view that as something that's interesting, something to explore. And when you do that, you will actually physically form neural connections. Your brain will actually grow. This Friday, September 9th, is our first hat day for this year. Stickers are $2 and can be bought Friday morning in the front entrance. Come join our Christian club during lunch every Friday. This club has a version of uniting the local church to impact our middle and high schools in the Permian Basin with the gospel message through student-led clubs. First priority will pick you up in the cafeteria and walk you to your assigned grade level room. Sixth grade lunch room 104, seventh grade lunch room 220, eighth grade lunch room 223. It starts this Friday. If you are interested in joining the dance club, they are taking applications for all grades from now until September 13th. Practices are in room 204 every Tuesday after school.